Hello everyone, I'm Rodney from 3GameMan.com and today I'm having a look at another slim all-in-one liquid CPU cooler from Silverstone. This time it's the TV-03 model. I already did a video review on the TV-02, but that one was a 240 millimeter AIO and this one is a 120. But what is common between them is the fact that they are slim. 37 millimeters in thickness, and that means you're going to be able to fit them in places that you wouldn't be able to fit other AIOs. It's packaged very well. Included is a user's manual, a 120 millimeter fan. The AIO itself, which as you can see is wrapped in plastic. And in this box, they include all the materials needed for installing this on any current socket, as well as the fan on the rad, thermal compound, and a Molex to four pin power fan adapter. Now the fan doesn't come installed, but of course this is very easy to do using the included screws. These all-in-ones are really becoming the norm for CPU cooling, and there's no wonder, right? Because they perform extremely well, are relatively affordable, and they're easy to install. If you compare this to to a fantastic CPU air cooler, well, the CPU air cooler will cost around the same price but won't perform quite as well. Beyond an AIO, there are the traditional water cooling setups, but of course, you'll need to select all the different components, so it's not quite as easy and it will cost substantially more, but of course, will outperform the AIO. So, this is really in the middle between a traditional water cooling setup and an excellent CPU air cooler. What I think most people find so attractive with this, everything is in one sealed loop, right? You've got the radiator, the fan or fans, the fittings, the tubes, the pump, and the cold plate. It comes with an aluminum radiator which measures in at 153 by 120 by 22 millimeters. Now, the thickness here is something to note. It is very thin at 22 millimeters because traditional rads will measure in at around 27 millimeters. The four pin PWM 120 by 120 by 15 millimeter fan has a rated voltage of 12. The current is from 0.02 to 0.15 amps. The airflow is 13.1 to 35.85 CFMs and the speed is 800 to 2200 RPMs. As well, the noise level is from 16.5 to 27.4 decibels. These rubber tubes are super flexible and durable. They measure in at 310 millimeters in length and are 12 millimeters in diameter. They connect to the radiator and water block very securely so you don't have to worry about them being ripped away. Now on the inside they have this eco-friendly glycol based coolant and it comes with a corrosion inhibitor added to prevent metal corrosion. Here's their logo and there's also an LED at the top. They include a three pin connector for powering the pump and the cold plate, well, is a nice smooth slab of copper. This is a perfect option, actually even better than their TD-02, which is a 240 millimeter AIO. This one is a 120, of course, and that means more possibilities. I suspect you'll be able to fit this in a lot of small form factor cases. So if that's what you're going for, this would definitely be something to consider. The performance is really good as well. It's pretty darn affordable. Overall, it's a kick-ass product. Until next time, Take care. Well, that's it, but I hope you enjoyed the review. And if you think this and other videos that I produce are great, please like them and subscribe to the channel. Also, your comments are very welcome. And if you have any questions, let me know.